What up, Dokkan Hunters? Welcome back to Junimami for another video on Dragon Ball Z! Dokkan Battle, we're bringing all Super Saiyan 4s plus a couple Heroes units on the Time Traveler Super Battle Road on Season 4. And let's begin. We're bringing a full Rainbow Squad. And we're going to be trying this first try, no items. Let's see how we do. As I mentioned, all Super Saiyan 4s. So, obviously, we're going to have a lot of support going in. And as you can see right here, we've actually got pretty decent setup. We're gonna have um, we're gonna have Broly and Gohan both focus on the bandage guy. Just take him out completely, and then we'll have Toa take over at the end, and we'll have him we'll have Toa target Devilman. Devilman is the scary unit. Um, so the idea here is obviously we're gonna have the Super Saiyan fours mainly take over. Maybe we'll have them a couple rotate out because. The Super Saiyan 3 Goku is really important. He can tank and he can stun pretty well. Same with the Gohan. And then Toa obviously is important for support, for healing, and for nerfing. So, actually, we might have Super Saiyan 4s on one rotation, then we'll have Toa on the other one. Toa has to be relevant, because if we're doing no items, we gotta make sure Toa can actually, you know, be around to do the no iteming portion. If she can't, well then we're in trouble. So, okay, there's our, there's our real first hit. Thankfully, because of Extreme Super Battle Road, everybody just assumes the worst, and we actually end up doing okay. So we'll be fine here. Uh, we'll have Vegito go first, just for the sake of the types, and also bringing some orbs down so we can get other people's super attack going. Um, let's just kill Invisible Guy. I don't think Bandage is going to do anything to me. If he does, well, maybe we can counter it. That's kind of the hope. And then we'll have Super Saiyan 3 actually go after the Skinny Devil Guy, and then Bardock can attack Devilman. We're gonna just go through this really fast, and I'm just gonna let you guys know over the next few days, I'm gonna keep my videos very simple, straightforward, single take videos, because I got a lot of stuff coming up both on YouTube and off, and I need to be able to take care of all of it before the end of the year. One of the big hurdles was the holiday special, so I'm glad you guys enjoyed that. That one took a lot of time and effort. Hopefully you guys checked it out if you did not. It is the main video on the channel, so make sure to go check that out. I worked really hard on it, I liked it. How it turned out obviously you know the perfectionist in me when it comes to music i'm just like you know what could have been a little better and next year it will be but in the in the spirit of the holiday season hopefully you guys enjoyed that share it around let people know that there is a music nerd in the dragon ball dokkan community so um as, as i'm saying um i want to be able to get my videos out i want to be able to work on those streams for before the world tournament and all my other stuff that i have to do so things are going to be a little hectic for me so my videos are going to be very straightforward with minimal little to no edits including summons if i do any sort of summons i'm going to keep those to a minimum as well just because i want to get these videos out and i can't really take the time to do my editing the way that i want to do it so i'd rather just not do it at all than do a half-assed job of it so hopefully you guys understand that so okay everybody's kind of just damaged here and there a little bit i think probably the better move is actually to give this one to mm, yeah probably just to give it to bandage and then Gohan will go second. We'll have Gohan go after Devil Man. Not a not a good not a good situation. We're all kind of helter skelter here, but it's okay because okay we're, we're countering this. We're countering this one. Yeah, people have been telling me in videos. You know, you know when they're gonna counter because the screen hesitates. I now know what that is because I've seen it. Because usually what happens when I do my super attack, I'll either look at chat during streams. Or when I'm doing videos, I'm focusing on just explaining stuff to you guys, right? So I've never actually seen, stopped and seen what the counter animation is, or that early warning sign of a, of a counter. Now I know, because I've been actually focusing on the gameplay itself. So, for those of you who've always been trying to tell me, well, I get it. So your work here is done. Whoa! That crit just... Can you kill him? We Oh, you got him. You got him. Broly just took him out. It was that Giga Destruction? Yeah, I'll say. Um, that turn is... That's over. Okay. Are we below 50%? We are not below 50%. Toa will not be healing us. Okay, this might be the absolute worst situation we've been in. Because Toa will not heal us. And we've got a lot of damage coming in. Okay, who do we stun? We gotta stun the red guy because the red guy's attacking the most. So we'll do that. We'll have Vegito. Oh, no, 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 no. Toa has to go second. Toa's got to nerf uh, the green guy. Let's just maximize our damage here. And then we'll have Vegito go after the Inf Lady. I can't remember their names. All I know is this is from, like, Demon of the Sleeping Castle or something from Dragon Ball. That vampire dude. I forget his name. 
But thankfully, this is regular Super Battle Road, so that tanking is coming in quite nicely. Also, the dual 70s kind of help a little bit. So, shout out to the Super Saiyan 4 Vegito for hooking us up. Oh, boy. Uh, okay, this is going to hurt. 44k. All right. We are definitely below. We're getting hit by everything! All right. I think we can hold our own next turn. If we can't, well, this video is gone because first try no item is, you know, in jeopardy. And I kind of feel like... I kind of feel like we could actually do this one. Like, I don't think we need to throw in any items just to save the video. I feel like this is totally doable. Um, we've nerfed the green guy twice. That doesn't matter too much. The main thing is we can actually probably do a lot of damage against her if we can get an additional, which we don't. Oh, boy. Okay, well, um, yeah. So we'll have Vegito attack Int again. We'll have Gohan attack... Uh, we'll have Gohan attack Int as well. Hopefully Int dies. And then we'll attack... Actually, let's just have everybody attack Int. Worst case scenario, the target will switch to the green guy. Gohan does have 40% damage reduction, so that's why I'm okay putting him in the middle. There we go. See, this is why my additional thing is better. We just killed her. We killed her and we raised our defense twice. Boom. Now this attacks... These, look at that. It does nothing because I raised my defense twice. All right, cool. So now we're focusing on the green guy. This will do more damage, which is even better. That does nothing. That does nothing. This does nothing. And this attack will not be a super attack because he is sealed. And he will be sealed once again thanks to Bardock. So the team is starting to cover each other. And there we go. We got the heal thanks to Toa. And Toa also gets a boost from her own passive. Because when she heals, she gives extreme class allies attack and defense plus 50. Plus 50. Very, very nice. So we're going to go ahead and go after... Actually, you know what? Let's just kill Let's just kill Green Guy. Green Guy's dead. Toa can attack uh, Viking Face. And then we'll have Broly attack Green Guy. And then we'll go after Viking Face afterwards. Again, don't know the names. Don't really care at this point. Just want to win. And we also need to be careful because we want to be done. I think on this next turn, we need to be done. Because if we don't, that Dokkan attack is going to happen here and not on the final fight, which is bad. That's very bad. I didn't even realize that. We may not do this. Because this guy's at full health, pretty much. Oh, man. Broly, you got to come through for me. Give me some just critical hits after critical hits. There's one. Can we do this? Can we do this? Okay, so I'm going to do that. I'm going to do that. Uh, we should be able to, Yeah, we, we can do it. He's not going to hit us with a super. We're good. We're good. All right. That's fine. We got this. Dokkan attack set. Next turn. Carnage. There will be maximum carnage. If you understand that, let me know right now in the comments. Let me know right now. Does that make sense? Did you get it? All right. So we got Toa. We got Super Saiyan 3. And we got Bardock. As far as the attack goes, this is going to suck because we don't have much damage here. So we'd probably have to do Bardock if anything, but we can't. Oh man, that's actually pretty rough. Alright, alright, it looks like... It looks like we're going to have to go after the guy in the middle with the Dokkan attack. It's a shame, but it is what it is. And we will have the targeted attack for Toa probably be... Hmm. We probably want it to be the STR, because STR attacks twice. The type advantage will not do anything to us. And then Bardock can attack. Bardock can attack the physical guy as well. And if it's if he's dead, then it'll focus on uh, the tech guy instead. Okay, so this is actually not going to do a whole lot of damage. But whatever damage we do end up taking, we will heal it back. Which will keep us alive next turn. And then Toa can ultimately heal us the turn after. And I messed up. Was expecting it to go very fast. Totally butchered this, man. I had such a good setup, and I... Whatever. That's just how it goes sometimes. Alright, and unfortunately, the stunning effect will not transfer over to everybody. That will just be for the physical guy. Everybody else will take just the damage part. So there we go. Oh, he's dead! Nice additional by Goku. Alright, so now Toa will target STR. STR will then be nerfed once, maybe twice. And sealed. So he will not do a super attack on me. If anything, it'll just be... Symbol? Is that his name? I don't know his name. Whatever. 
Uh, but we're fine. And we also did a Dokkan attack, right? So whatever we, whatever damage we dealt, we'll heal it back at the end. Look at that, full health. Okay, so red is sealed, green is sealed, blue is not. So if Broly goes first, that's fine. But we're actually going to have Gohan go first because he's an actual tank. So Gohan will go after Piccolo. We'll have Vegito go after uh, Symbol again. I don't know, I forgot. And then Broly can attack Red Guy. So everybody's got their mission. Everybody's got their attack plan. Let's do this. Let's do this. No items. First try. Time Travelers. Dragon Ball Heroes. Super Saiyan 4. Okay, so we stunned. So that's good. Can we get that additional now? Come on, buddy. Come on. One more. One more. There you go. Ooh, counter. He countered. Full counter. I think we're going to kill him. No! Oh! oh, that would have been so nice. That would have been so nice. All right, well, you're dead. Yeah, you're gone. <laughs> Give me one more super. One more. Well, there it is. Out of boy, Broly. Dude, Broly's so good. I'm so glad I was able to rainbow this guy. These Super Saiyan 4s, man. They're some of my favorites in the entire game. All right, same thing. If it ain't broke, don't fix it. We do that. We do that. And that is game, folks. Don't even, even, I'm putting down my phone, we're done. So that is Time Traveler's Super Battle Road. Now, there's no secret to this one. You know, obviously if you summon on the Heroes banner, you got these units. You don't have to have them rainbowed to get this done. I love this category because these Super Saiyan 4s are awesome. They're a whole lot of fun. Also, my girl Freaky Toa is there. By the way, I created the name, all mine. Just letting you know. So I, I always knew this was gonna be something that I did. A lot of people thought that, you know, it was like, uh, it was something that just no one ever thought about. But I'm pretty sure everybody who picked up these heroes units were thinking. when The second they saw Time Travelers as a Super Battle Road category, they're like, oh, can you imagine? Yeah. So, yeah. Uh, we're done. Oh, wait, we're not actually done. What the? Boo! All right, Gohan, hurry up. Gohan, do it. Uh, Vegito, do it. And Bardock. One extra turn. Look at, look at the health, man. We could have been done before. Had we had more additionals, it would have been over by now. See that? This is why additionals are so important. So Gohan with the finishing move, and that is it. No items. First try. Time Travelers, you love to see it. You love to see it. You don't have to go Future Saga. You can, or you can have fun by using a more fun team. And I use the best team. All rainbows, all the time. Thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed the video, be sure to leave a like down below. Let me know in the comments your thoughts on Dragon Ball Heroes making a resurgence in Super Battle Run. This is probably gonna be the one category that you can enjoy with heroes because you're not, I don't know if we're gonna get a Dragon Ball Hero Super Battle Run at some point. I don't know, it just doesn't seem likely. But let me know your thoughts about the category and using this team in the comments down below. Also be sure to subscribe for more dope content in the future and click the notification bell so that you let YouTube know you wanna see more of my stuff. Do it! Thanks again, stay tuned, and always remember to Dokkan responsibly. What up Toa? Toa's mine, back off. Freaky Toa, she's mine. All mine.